Okay, everybody, we're moving forward a little bit. Uh, this is our ninth no, video. Uh, we're getting close to get communist. Uh, what happened? Uh, we we took one of the Chinese cities, which was uh, across London. It was a great person, so allowed me to flip the city because of my culture, um, which is another plus. And right now we're using our cruisers and tanks to move forward against the American, uh, especially because you know you guys remember they were ahead in the economy race. So right now we are we, we need to do something about it before it's too late. Uh, even with the Chinese attacking me uh, from the from the bottom with cannons, uh, I really need to do something about the the American. I can't really have two strong enemies during the whole game. So somebody need to pay. Uh, yeah, right now we're going for mass production so we can have those uh, uh, advanced modern infantry ready uh, for for defense so after that I should be probably forget about defense so you guys see we still have our beautiful knights which are now uh, tanks uh, defending London and we're gonna use probably to move forward to to Washington see what can take care of them uh, very important uh, as a use a uh, keep a spy with you so you can uh, try to disrupt the defense for the enemy or do something else like in this case I love kidnapping uh, great persons uh, beautiful so especially because we are heading cult in culture so more great person is like a it's never 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 bad so that's why it's always very important to to have spies. I mean, I'm using every single game, but um, <coughs> it, it is important from time to time to remind you that uh, uh, you need to keep them rolling. As soon as you have uh, more than one, uh, more than three, four cities, you can start pumping spies from one, so you can start getting all those extra bonuses, and they're gonna also help you a lot, especially if you're. Uh, <coughs> If you are in, in offense, so you, because you can disrupt the fortifications. So we got our riflemen and our tanks, which are moving forward Washington. And we have the, our our bunch of yeah, we have a bunch of cruisers in there. In it's sitting the Washington. So we're gonna probably move some other spies in there, so we can do something. Uh, yeah, our production city is doing just fine. Now we are the iron mine, so you guys can see we have like a five or six hammers, five hammers in the in the mountain in the left side. Uh, so actually, we're using this one to pump uh, units and also build some wonders, special wonders. In this case, yeah, this company will be will be great. We can get in ten turns, so it's can't, we can't go wrong with that. And now I'm building some some roads between the cities. As I explained to you before, we are I mean the the cities from the left side are a little bit far away, and they're still getting attacked very often. So it's very important to to keep them connect so you can move your troops very fast. Um, yeah, we're gonna move these tanks in here. We gotta get rid of Washington as soon as possible. Right now, as you can see, got 31. Uh, extra in attack because just enough of support so it is really really important to use that bonus in the late game uh, if you're playing with England uh, yeah, yeah, let's just clean these riflemen's um, <coughs> for their fortification make them a little more strong uh, so so far well uh, now I can s really say that uh, uh, we're moving very well, um, oh. nice. We can probably finish with mass production real quick. Um, because I really need to to take care of the the defense in those cities in the left side. Uh, yep, 
now we have some people coming into my production city so it's very important to to be ready uh, I got a settler just create a new settler in there I need another another small city that's gonna be just for I don't know modern infantry or spies um, yeah I know it, it can get very very uh, we're gonna use this one also for gold production actually I forgot to tell you those, that guy but uh, uh, it's important to have some cities just with some r roles in particular especially small cities I know it's kinda tough to keep a uh, micromanagement of all those the cities but uh, uh, you get used to it it's just practice you, you as, l as long as you have in your in your head what is the what is the, the plan uh, which units are gonna be which cities are for what we should be in good shape uh, yeah probably we might need to go for for religion even if it's kind of late but uh, we we can get those cathedrals um, going for more culture like uh, we need more but uh, you know it's important to to be ahead in the culture race just in case we are unable to break their your enemy defense you need to always have a another possibility of victory and even even if you're attacking or trying to get a domination victory uh, it's very important to have another cities doing something else uh, like a focus in, in, a, in economy or in uh, or in science so you have a no, you have a chance in case you have a problem breaking defenses. You have a, at least you have a chance to to have another kind of victory. That's especially very important multiplayer. Okay, we got finally Washington. Uh, so the American is falling apart. That was the whole plan since the beginning. Uh, but the Sulu has been very quiet, so I'm pretty sure the Sulu is going to be one of probably my last opponent. It will still survive, of course. I mean, I'm not saying that the game is in there. It is completely secure, but uh, uh, now with combustion and our cruiser providing us with naval support, we are in very, very good shape. Um, Let's get rid of this guy before we got a settler coming. And uh, I remember in the in the bottom of that place it was like a hmm, yeah we can build our city over there. So you guys see we have like a two or three cities destined for science, uh, two others just for for gold production. So we have our some options in case something goes out of him, and uh, especially when you play multiplayer, uh, I know some the the easy way is just to get the the domination victory. But uh, if you play against opponents like the Russians or England, uh, because they have some very strong. Uh, defenses uh, it is important to have an extra another way to 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 win the game right it's not I remember it's not all about force this is in game this is in real life it's not all about power I mean sometimes you gotta be smart and come up with special plans and if you check the history of the war you're gonna see that some of the Big fight. The, the, I mean, the winner wasn't the strongest; was the most intelligent one. But uh, that's another story. We're not gonna do some history lessons now. For now, and um, yeah. So so far, the we gotta finish with the American now. So probably in the next video, we're gonna move forward a little bit more because I'm pretty sure they have some a lot of small cities ahead of me. So uh, not gonna, they, I mean, it's been a been a very long video so we're gonna probably move forward a little more okay see you guys in the next one